360 includes your history. Mm -hmm. uh, how are you feeling about it? Uh, I felt pretty good about it. I was feeling good in my warm up, and uh, me and my coaches were working on my start and acceleration all week, so I just put it together in the final, and you know, that's time. So you know, I felt pretty good about it. You've been second a couple times. Uh, what does it mean to now be finally break through that title? It feels great. Um, you know, it's just something I've been always been working for, being national champion. Um, so you know, just got to keep working. You think? Do you think coming in today you could run 6:45? Um, I just knew like the sky was the limit. I felt pretty good this morning. You know, I warm up and I just want to execute. You know, the time is just, you know, icing on the cake. You ended up winning by a decent amount. Did that surprise you? Um, you know, I, I, didn't, I didn't know. Uh, so, I, I guess so, yeah. You've had a great season so far. 6 5 won a few times. Tell us what's been the difference for you this year. Uh, just, I mean, I changed a lot of little things, like getting more rest. Um, you know, I, I changed a lot of my diet. You know, just coming to practice and, you know, executing on the little things coach has been telling me about. And so, you know, that really helped me um, in the offseason and coming into this season. That uh, paid off of that 6 4 five. Yeah, for sure, definitely. <laughs> I still got a 200 coming up. Ronnie, Ronnie ran 645 uh, last, last week at US Indoor. So, to, uh, to you guys, uh, two fastest guys in the world, uh, how, how much would you uh, be looking forward to uh, seeing him again down the line? Uh, I mean, Ronnie, he, you know, he's a friend of mine. Uh, he's a great runner. And um, salute to him. He won uh, USA. So, you know, that was a good run. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to racing him whenever. So, you know, um, it should be a good race. Whenever, yeah. Seems like yeah. there's a new crop of young US sprinters. Are you excited to be a part of that, or? Uh, definitely excited. Um, you know, United States is, you know, uh, usually, you know, always on top of the world. So, you know, trying to help USA get back there, you know, that's, you know, definitely uh, one, of my, one of my goals. You said you changed your diet. Uh, what specifically did you change? Specifically, um, you know, just not eating fast food. Um, you know, trying not to eat fried food. You know, just in general, trying to you know eat healthy. You know, a lot of times you know runners like we, we run it off, so you don't really think about your you know diet like that. So you know, just little things like not eating sweets and fried food and stuff like that. So, outdoors, what what's the goal for you? I'm um, not even sure. I'm just worried about the 200 right now. <laughs> How your world's been from high school to now? Do you think this would change this much to be who you are now? I mean, obviously you probably thought you'd run fast, but you've changed a lot. Uh, for sure. I mean, high school, uh, I thought my main sport would be football. And so um, when I, you know, accepted the track scholarship, uh, that was just my main focus. And I had to, you know, transform my body into a, a, a sprinter's body and, um, you know, just working on little things that I didn't work on in high school, obviously. And, you know, um, it's turned out pretty good. Good job. Where'd Thanks. you get the tattoo? Where'd I get it? When? Um, when? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> like last fall, I don't know, a little while ago. Yeah. Excellent. Cool. Thanks. Thanks. Welcome to two.